Right, so day following. Oh, I'm using the wrong bloody things here. Obviously having another shot at this. Oh, oh god, this is a bad idea. Move! Oh! oh I swear I just shot it on top of myself then. Wow, this has gone terribly already. Um, yeah, I made a save just in the safe room prior to this, so uh, hopefully things will go a bit better here. Though, uh, looking at this, not really. I've been aiming at the wrong things. I uh, forgot there's two triggers that aim at different things. One that obviously um, allows you to aim at environmental things, and then another that will aim at the nemesis, and I've already been doing the wrong thing. Okay, well, I can still do this, I think. Kind of hope, more like. We just need to freeze the shit out of him here. Right. Oh shit, that one's not actually topped up. Right, we need to get him into this area here, really. In front of this one. It's the next chance, really, to uh, actually set this thing on top of him. It's a shame I don't have the mine thrower. I feel I should do, really, but oh well. Right. There we go, got him again, right, okay, now we need to uh, get to the other side of him and quickly turn on this thing here. Right, okay, shit, move out the way, Jill. Move it. Is that actually gonna cover him, or what? Doesn't appear to be doing anything to him, shit. Uh, maybe he wasn't under it. I don't know. I think he's back up, though, either way. I can't hear him moving. He should be frozen again now. Yeah, he is. A bit too far away again. Ah, uh, what to do? What to do? I need to move him a bit closer. I'll let him move a bit next time. So, we're getting there, I think. Right, he must be back up now. One, two... Oh, okay, I got him anyway. Oh my god, his head fell off. I don't think there's much recovering from that. Kind of wasn't expecting his head to actually fall off. Right, so card key is sliding out of the scientist's pocket there. I'm guessing that's what I want, but I still have this damn time limit, don't I? Shit. Right, I don't know what I'm doing with this. I'm guessing I need to just ditch the factory as quickly as possible. Is there anything in this room? Oh, there's multiple of these things. I didn't realise they were all around the room. I thought they were just in that strip there. Right, we're obviously not going that way. We need to do something with the card key, don't we? And there were several things we could do with the card key, so I need to quickly remember what the fuck those were. Uh, there was, uh... The one way back. Uh, I think that's probably the first thing I should do. Oh, what's going on here? Looks like it's all been dumped into some kind of toxic waste there. Missile attack confirmed. All personnel evacuate immediately. Oh, don't worry, I'll do that. I'll do that. So, judging by the fact we're now needing to evacuate some area... Oh, right. Okay, it appears um, the, count the timer has actually gone. Um, what was I going to say? I'm, I'm guessing we're near the end of the game, because uh, doesn't every si single one of the games seem to have, like, a bloody timer by the end of it? Um, so where should I go? The first place I can think of that we probably would need to go is all the way back to the beginning of this area. Because there was a few, um, there was that wave machine, and next to it there was something else. What? Okay, there's more zombies appeared here. Yeah, let's go through this door. Seems to be the safest bet, really. Uh, how many items do I have left? Oh, I actually only used the big herb. I'm surprised. I did quite a good job with that fight then, after all. I thought I did terrible. It's so the freeze rounds just bloody shut them down, don't they? I only need three shots. But it's a shame I couldn't use the acid more. I think I got him once with them, but once really isn't good enough. Um, I should probably get the fire rounds out. I think those are... Uh, liquors? Can't tell. No, they're these bastard things. Piss off. These kill them one hit. No, they don't, apparently. Ah, oh, I need to be really careful with these, though. Right, what's going on with the water? There's something in the water there, isn't there? Am I supposed to be doing something with it? No, I'm guessing not. Ugh, I can't see them down the damn stairs. They're, the first time I'm going to see them is when they're coming at me. Hopefully I can hit them from here. Oh shit, no, I missed that. Oh, crap. 
Oh, fuck, fuck, fuck. Get off me, get off me. Prick. There we go. I think that one's dead. Yeah, we hit it head on there. Plus it got hit by the other one that we fired, so it's alright. Hopefully they don't keep on respawning, because that would be really irritating, but that is likely. I mean, come on. It's Resident Evil. It's not going to make the game easy for me, is it? Okay, um... There's a safe room here. I can ditch a load of stuff in there. It's probably best we make some more freeze rounds, really, because, uh... How much... We don't have many left. Oh, and I'm guessing the Nemesis isn't done for. He did slide into, like, the contaminated water. I'm guessing he mutates again or something like that into something even ridiculously bigger than he already is. Like William Birkin did in the, uh, second game. Okay, um... Oh! Might also notice that I carried the Magnum round with me. I don't know why I didn't use it, because, well, I'm guessing the free, freeze rounds kind of did the job anyway, so... We need to make more fire, flame rounds and freeze rounds, really, and then deposit the shotgun shells. Uh, perhaps uh, run a bit lighter as well with equipment. Alright, so I switched my inventory up again. Uh, I decided to ditch off the freeze rounds because uh, we didn't actually have enough gunpowder to make anymore. Instead, I've got the magnum with me with all the rat, uh, bullets that I made for it. Right, so uh, where was it? It was this thing here, wasn't it, that wanted the card. Tiny slot where a plastic card could fit. So let's insert that. Oh, really? This is still the wrong card. I honestly would have thought that we'd have the right card by now, but clearly not. Is it the card on the key, perchance? Oh my god, it is! I never would have thought of that. Because I have had the key for a good long while, haven't I? Uh, yeah, let's take the key back. So what's this all about, then? Applied to the water? Right. I don't understand. I don't fully understand what it... what's going on here. Ultraviolet rays have, are applied to the water. Do we need something to put the water in or something? Oh shit, maybe I was supposed to come back here later when I have some kind of conical flask or something like that. I don't know, but there are loads sat on the table here. Loads of things we could contain this water in. I bet we still acquire something that we can put water in and we have to come all the way back despite all this shit on the table that we could probably use. But anyway, it looks like we're going to have to go back through the... through the factory to the other side where we could um, use the card key before. That'd be the area that Nikolai locked off and also um, the uh, the lift, the elevator. Oh, for crying out loud, they have bloody respawned again. This is getting a bit ridiculous, isn't it? Are these things blind? I get the feeling they're not, but... Oh wait, maybe they are actually. That seems to be detecting me on- oh, never mind. Ignore everything I said. Right, okay, I'm not gonna kill the last one, I'm just gonna run past it, cause it's in the water over there. And boom. Do the same again. Okay, we're taking these down quite easily. And... boom. Oh, come on, I thought I had all of them with that one. There we go. Right. Are we just passing through here? I suppose I should be careful, like... Should have a good look around, just in case they keep on respawning. Because having to come back in here again and again and again would be quite irritating. Uh, so where do we go? Do we go through the place where Nikolai was, or do we go up the elevator? It looks like there's just one room, but it looks like there's an elevator in that room. If you look at the bottom of the map there. Uh, as for the... Elevator? Fuck knows where that goes. I think we'll go for the elevator first, see where that goes, and then we can check that room out, because there's still these things in the room here, which is going to be a bit irritating to deal with. So... Oh, wait. Have they despawned? I think they may have despawned, actually. They don't seem to be there. Either they're all... Oh, I don't know. Who cares? Right, I'll restock my shotgun and we'll keep moving. Now I should be able to use the card key on this. At least I hope so, anyway. Yep, there we go. So now we can use this elevator. I never thought it could go... Oh yeah, there we go, it does go down. I thought it was going up. Right, so where's this? Oh, whatever it is, it's got some um, useful grenade ammo here. Oh, it's the room that was locked off. Or seemed to be cut out, anyway. Where is this? It's a 
damn good point. I'm not entirely sure. Right, the grenade rounds, we could add um, power to those to upgrade them to flame rounds, I guess. Uh, but I have no idea where we are. Let me just double check the map, because I'm kind of worried about what's on the other side of that door there. Oh, fuck knows, actually. Let's just try and use it, shall we? It's closed with a sturdy looking door. There's a tiny slot where a plastic card could fit. This is either going to be the key... Well, I think it's going to be the key one, because she said tiny again, didn't she? It's a bit odd that you used the, uh... Oh, right, what the fuck is that? A rocket launcher! Oh, wow, that's brilliant. So we've got a rocket launcher now. Jesus Christ. Okay, then, uh... I'm guessing we're coming up to some kind of finale here, then. Because normally that's that shit's uh, given to us buy someone randomly at the end of the game, but not in this game, apparently. Okay. Definitely gonna need that to finish off the last boss, though. Rocket Launch is always the most powerful thing in the game. Well, it was in the past, too, anyway. So what do I keep on me, and what do I get rid of? Well, we can upgrade those into flame rounds. Oh, we got more from that, actually. That moved into seven. So we have uh, three inventory slots, technically three, because the blue herb and the green herb can be combined. Uh, I guess we'll go check out the other room, then. And hopefully there are no um, enemies in between me and that room. Hopefully they have just despawned, because I had a feeling they had, based on the fact it was very quiet in this room over here. Or corridor, should we call it. Can't hear, there's a lot of things going on in my house at the moment, unfortunately, so... No, there's nothing here, great. Okay, so we can get through here. Ah, right. It's either that or I killed them at some point and just forgot. Oh, zombie is behind this door. You no longer need this card key. We discard of it, yes. Ah, there, no problem. Got my shotgun here for that. Just depending on how close they are, I can't see. There we go, that was really close, actually. Just didn't notice. Whoa, whoa, whoa! That's a bit rude. Literally fell to my leg and then decided to use that to his advantage. No, fuck off. I was lucky I didn't move any further forward then. I didn't realise the other one wasn't dead. More green herbs. Eh. Alright then. I'm getting a bit kind of confused where all the red herbs are going, but oh well. If we have enough green herbs, it's equal to a red herb, I guess, plus a green herb. And we have plenty more than enough now. Uh, so, is this the way out, or...? I'm guessing not. Because, uh, we still have one mystery left to solve. Which is way back where. Uh... On the other hand, this might be the exit. Getting a bit worried now. Bit of a, uh, lookout here going on. What's this? It's a portable radar receiver. You've got the radar receiver. Alright then. I don't know what the fuck that's for. You're still alive. Such persistence. Nikolai? Sorry, but there is no escape from here. Is he in that helicopter, perchance? Really? Oh look, it's something I can't actually do in the game. Duck. Right, so negotiate with Nikolai or return fire to the chopper. I don't think I'm going to negotiate with Nikolai. That seems a bit of a silly idea. I'm just going to return the bloody fire. Oh, it's actually put me in charge of doing that. Right, here's the rocket launcher. This would be the most effective thing for blowing up a helicopter, I think. So yeah, fuck you, Nikolai. Suck my dick. Well, that's him certainly dealt with. So what's this radar for? If it didn't detect a bloody helicopter, what does it detect? Jill, what happened? Search. Carlos. I murdered Nikolai. The choppers. I guess this is it then. But I don't want to die in a place like this. This isn't over yet. I'm not giving up, Jill. We still have a chance. He suddenly changed his attitude. I love the way she casually holds that with one hand. I mean, um, you know, it doesn't loot that light unless it's really, really dense. 
Uh, what's he doing? I am not going to give up. Yeah, dig that. Right. Jill, that's it. We've got to find a way out of here now. Well, yeah, no shit. But um, what? You just gonna leave me again? Warning. Missile attack confirmed. Warning. Missile attack confirmed. Emergency level D. Oh no, not All D. It means so much to me. Right, that's shut, so there's no going back that way by the looks of it. It's a bit odd since, uh, what the fuck's that? Something on the radar there. Okay then. Uh, well I'm gonna try, uh, oh wait, oh wait, that's the missile, okay, right, fuck this, let's just go down here, forget about anything else. Yeah, down the ladder, forget everything else. Hopefully I've got enough inventory space to pick up anything along the way, but that said, uh, oh my god, my save point was way back, wasn't it? Right, what's Jill looking at over here? There's a lot of zombies in here, isn't there? I'm a bit worried. A little bit worried. Actually, the the pausing might not be stopping the countdown that's going on here. A little bit worried about that. Um, right, what I'm going to do is I'm going to combine all these green herbs into one uh, green herb. But I'll do that in the case that I need to, if you get what I'm saying. So let's just keep moving. If we go around this way, hopefully we should just be able to get around here without actually bumping into any of these bastards. Fuck that. Well, that was alright. Okay, um, anything here? Yes, there is. Oh shit, it's shotgun shells. We don't really need shotgun shells. But, could be useful, I guess. How many? Uh, one set. No, we'll just take one of them. Uh, oh, actually, actually, what's the point in taking one of them when I'm not going to fill the entire shotgun? Right, come on, keep moving. I need to be careful. I mean, I don't know how long this uh, time has actually given me here. But it doesn't seem that long at all. In other news, I might want to change the weapon that I have as well. Alright, so what's this all about? We have a car park? No. Why would. This isn't a bloody car park. What am I on about? It's a car crushing facility, more like. What's this on the floor? Alright, classified photo file. In my opinion, I feel that it's too early to use the. Uh, Priscilla sword in actual fighting. However, in order to acquire the G virus that Umbrella has developed, it would be great to help us. I don't know if the time's still rolling, by the way. The power of the rail cannon is satisfactory, but please note that it's still having a few remaining problems. Technology Division Colonel Franklin Haas. And you do think we're going to be using this uh, cannon per chance? I think that's highly a possibility based on the fact it was mentioned. Special Force member body lies here. Just checking to see if there's any items. I'm not doing a very good job of this whole, you know, urgency thing, am I? I'm trying. I'm trying, guys. I'm trying. Alright, where are we now? That's broken. What's this? A power distributor unit that uh, that is not working now. Uh, is that the... Ne that's the fucking nemesis, isn't it? This is one of Umbrella's... Deadly bioweapons. Oh wait, no it isn't. It's the boss from the first game. A transportation pod is Mark T. I think it is anyway. Or it's either, it looks kind of like Mr. Mr. X kind of guy going on here. But either way, I'm not too happy with that being there. It doesn't for me joy. Oh look, another rocket launcher that we could clearly use, but not really because Jill doesn't want to pick it up. A power distribution unit that is not working now. What's this? System. Pardon? Right. Power distribution units around the room. There's three of them. Checking battery. Right. Warning. There is not enough power to activate the system. Oh, fuck. Okay. So we need to do something in order to power it, I'm guessing. Power distribution units is Mark 3. No shit. Let's just keep moving and we'll see if we can find anything. I don't know if there's any doors in here. I hope there is because it seems to be the only thing we can do. Power is going outside. It cannot be unlocked now. What? Right. But what else can we do here? I actually don't see anything, so... Um... I mean, we could go back, but I don't think that's going to be any use, really. Is Mr. Bioweapon going to wake up and help us or something? What about this thing? 
Isn't one of them highlighted a different colour or something? It's orange. Uh, circuit's core port, a huge cable connects it. Um, well, we can't go back, can we? Yeah, I know. A transportation pod, Mark T. Can we climb up here? No. It looks kind of like we can, but never mind. I've only seen two of them so far. Where's the third one? I can't see it anywhere in this room. It's two, one, two. Yeah, where's the third one? Oh, come on. Just keep looking. Just keep looking. US Special Forces member. No use at all. Corpses aren't useful to us. Let's have a look around. Control panel to ma uh, manage to supply the power of external devices. Yeah, yeah. Number three. This isn't helping. Come on. No, oh, number two's here. I have checked it. Shit. I don't have a bloody clue what we're doing then. I literally have no idea. Uh, don't we have anything that we can do here? Uh, this is no use. Right, we'll check the door again. See if it allows us to go back out, which probably won't, but oh well. It's worth a go, isn't it? No. Yep, yeah, not happening. Right, what the fuck? What the actual fuck am I doing here? I have ran around this room several times now, just clicking everything, so I don't think this, it's going to make any difference what I do. I am genuinely stuck in this tiny, tiny room. Smart 3. Uh, and 1 is the only one that has a slight difference, and it's with this box here. And also the fact that it has a, a orange light as opposed to... Um, the regular green or red or whatever it was. I think it was red. It looks like we can climb over here, but we definitely can't. Map. Yeah, it looks like there is some kind of area in the middle that we can get into, but I can't see it for shit. There must be a way we can climb up. I'm just going to try one more time to have a sweep around here to see if we can actually climb up. I don't think we can, though. I mean, I've tried several times, I'm pretty sure, but to no avail, you know. No, nothing. Nothing we can do. Oh, can't, we can't push them, can we? Oh my god, what if we can push things? That can't be the case. That can't be right. Well, that was really anticlimactic. I thought it would put up like a cutscene or something like that, but no, it's just, uh, boom, and you're dead. Oh, well, that was a bit of a shame. I really messed up there. I mean, the last save was way back.